we may have to rewrite all the textbooks on the beginning of the universe. The implications of recent discoveries by the James Webb Space Telescope JWST, are staggering. It has identified six galaxies that existed a mere half a billion years after the Big Bang, and astonishingly, these galaxies are up to ten times larger than our own Milky Way. This revelation challenges fundamental assumptions about cosmic evolution and raises profound questions about the timeline of galactic formation. The JWST's detection of one of the oldest galaxies known to humanity is particularly striking. This galaxy is not only ancient but also incredibly massive and luminous. Characteristics that defy conventional explanations if we adhere strictly to current models of early universe dynamics. Michio Kaku, a prominent physicist in the United States, has suggested that these findings signal the dawn of a new era in cosmology and physics. He posits that the discrepancies uncovered by the JWST could provide fertile ground for revisiting and possibly revising theories, such as string theory and the concept of the multiverse. Moreover, Kaku humorously acknowledges the irony that these discoveries are forcing us to reconsider our foundational understanding of the cosmos. The implications extend beyond mere theoretical musings. The JWST has effectively exposed flaws in our existing cosmological and astrophysical paradigms. The Hubble tension, a persistent discrepancy in the measured rate of the universe's expansion, has troubled astronomers since the 1990s. While previous observations hinted at anomalies, the JWST's precision has brought these inconsistencies into sharp relief. The notion that the universe began with a singular event, the Big Bang, some 13.8 billion years ago, now faces significant scrutiny. How could galaxies of such size and complexity have formed a mere 250 million years after this cataclysmic event? This question challenges the conventional understanding that galaxy evolution is a slow, gradual process requiring billions of years to form structures resembling the Milky Way. Webb's observations have unearthed dozens of ancient galaxies, each possessing unique shapes and sizes that defy easy explanation. These galactic anomalies are accompanied by the discovery of exceptionally massive black holes exceeding a billion solar masses within a mere 500 million years post-Big Bang. Such revelations not only undermine established theories but also compel us to reassess our entire framework for understanding cosmic evolution and the early universe. Kaku and other forward-thinking scientists argue that these discoveries represent a watershed moment in our understanding of the cosmos. They highlight that previous hints of discordance, such as ambiguous light sources detected by the Hubble Space Telescope in the early universe, were harbingers of the deeper revelations now being uncovered by the JWST. For example, the galaxy GZ9P3, initially observed as a faint speck by Hubble, revealed itself under JWST's scrutiny to possess a redshift indicative of its existence just 510 million years post-Big Bang, a time when the universe was still in its infancy. This galaxy, GZ9P3, challenges our expectations of galactic maturity. Its dual bright spots hint at a possible merger of two primordial galaxies. An event thought to be rare in the early universe due to the supposed youthfulness of cosmic structures during that era. Moreover, chemical signatures within GZ9P3, such as silicon, carbon, and iron, elements indicative of older stars, are perplexing. These elements typically form through stellar evolution processes that require significant time spans, raising questions about the pace at which galaxies and stars formed in the early universe. The Hubble tension, which stems from conflicting measurements of the universe's expansion rate using different observational methods, further complicates our understanding. While satellite measurements of the cosmic microwave background consistently yield a Hubble constant around 67-68 km per second per megaparsec, measurements from standard candles like Type Ia supernovae suggest a higher value of about 73-74 km per second per megaparsec. This discrepancy underscores fundamental uncertainties in our understanding of dark matter, dark energy, and the overall composition of the universe. In light of these complexities, 
scientists are increasingly considering alternative explanations for the observed phenomena. Some propose that systematic errors in measurement methods could be skewing results. While others speculate that our current models of dark matter and dark energy may require substantial revision. Looking ahead, the notion of a singular Big Bang origin for the universe is being re-evaluated. Kaku and others suggest that these discoveries may support a multiverse hypothesis, a scenario where multiple universes exist, each governed by different physical laws. Such a perspective challenges the notion of a definitive beginning to everything, suggesting instead that our universe is just one among many. In summary, the revelations from the JWST have sparked a paradigm shift in cosmology, challenging established concepts and prompting a re-evaluation of foundational theories. These discoveries open new avenues for exploring the mysteries of the universe. As we stand on the brink of this new era, defined by both uncertainty and possibility, one thing is evident. Our perception of the cosmos has undergone a profound transformation, ensuring that our understanding will never be the same again. Thank you for watching another episode of Alizeb while you are still here don't forget to like and subscribe.